like majority votes i won't lie majority votes are great unless you're in the minority in which case i can i can agree but you know what if you're in the minority it just happens you can just have to sway people over to your minority to make it the majority so i'm gonna go with mr blue <gasps> Awesome music coming from my headset, which means, first of all, I probably need to turn the volume down. Just, just a little bit, but since it's blaring from my headset. But let me tell you, I know only one thing about this game, and I'm not, I'm not even like, ooh, really set to record yet. <clears throat> I'm not set to record, I don't have my, my headset on. That's when I'm like, ooh, recording mode. But yeah, let's let's actually put that on because I I've already clicked start recording and it's been like 40 seconds of <laughs> yeah that is that is a bop if I've ever heard one. All right, great. Are you ready? Are you ready? Good day, good people. Your United States Aviator is back in this fine day in the year of the Aviator. Welcome to your turn to die. A lot of you guys have really been wanting me to play this game, and I've been waiting to play this game. If you have never heard of Your Turn to Die, what are you doing? Uh, to be fair, if you guys didn't tell me about it, I would have heard about it, I think. I've heard about it and I was like, I need to check that out at some time. But, this is Your Turn to Die. It's been described to me as having elements of Danganronpa and Zero Escape. Which is like perfect for me in this channel because those are like some of my, a few of my favorite things. But let's go ahead, let's go ahead and start. Your Turn to Die, it is a death game by majority. Let's begin. <sighs> what am I getting myself into? <laughs> yes? Hey! Hiya! Just a random question, but do you know what a majority vote is? Yeah, yeah it's, it's just, you know, when the majority, like, all you only need is 50, 51% and you're good. Yeah, yeah. Ah ha ha ha, no need to get mad, it's helpful to start conversations with an easy question. Oh! Looks like somebody's over there. Ah, Mr. Blue. <laughs> I do love majority votes. Yes, I do. They represent the way democracy should be. Following the will of the people. It's a method that minimizes conflict. Thank you, Mr. Blue. Miss Red. Oh, I do declare. I hate majority votes. They're just a way to silence the minority. It only makes more darkness build in the shadows. Alright, Miss Red. That was... Did not expect for you to take a turn down that way so fast. Alright. <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's fine, I guess. Alright, what's up? <sighs> Sounds like they're having some tedious argument. Incidentally, whose opinion do you support, Mr. Blue's or Miss <laughs> Red's? I mean... Like majority votes, I won't lie. Majority votes are great. Unless you're in the minority, in which case I can I can agree. But you know what? If you're in the minority, it just happens. You just have to sway people over to your minority to make it the majority. So I'm gonna go with Mr. Blue. <gasps> what did I do? Ah, oh, she died. But good for you, your opinion had more supporters. Alright, this game is gonna be a ride, isn't it? You guys didn't tell me about this, oh boy. <clears throat> in the end, the majority is absolute. That's how it goes when you live in society. Hmm? What's with that look? You mean my look from earlier when I was like... If you had known the other person would die, you wouldn't have voted? Yeah, I probably wouldn't have. I mean, I just would have sat here. I- oh no, this is also going to... 
Sheesh, that won't get you anywhere, okay? It's what the game is all about. You don't look pleased, huh? Alright, if you insist, let's hold a vote. Your opinion versus mine. Okay then, let's go. Who are you? Oh, did he just murder me? Well, since I am dead, this has been your United States Aviator taking off. Fine day in the year of the Aviator. Toodaloo flight crew, I am dead. Peace out. Okay, now we're, we're fine. We're fine. Let's just, let's just get right into this. Alright, so that was a pretty strong start, I won't lie. Ooh, my pixelated hands. Well, hello. How do you do? What do I what do I do with these hands? Oh. I have to click. I was like I'm pressing every button. Alright, well that's some sort of announcement from Monokuma. Either it's daytime, morning announcement, it's either the nighttime announcement, or um, a body has been discovered! Alright, I did not expect this game to get going so fast. Alright, okay. <laughs> I had a weird dream that I was about to strangle some- My jaw is sore. Because I was sleeping with my head on my desk. This late already? I have to go home. Better hurry. Wow. <laughs> That's hilarious. Whoa. It's gone completely dark. Touch spots that looks interesting to investigate. Alright, well. The campus pond. There's a rumor that if you look at it, uh, into it at midnight, your reflection will talk to you. Could be a great thing to a loner. Alright, who are we? We are... Uh, that's your ID number. Okay, I was so confused. I was like, we're Samaru... I know. <laughs> Second year. We're Sarah. Okay, great. Oh, and we can... You guys know how I love to save. We're Sa And what a beautiful saving sound that is. Oh, man. I need... This is the start of a fresh game. Let's have ourselves like a saving counter because you guys know how I feel about saving. Any chance I get. Before anything happens, your boy saves. Alright. The sky? This thing? The lights are on. Maybe it's a guard. Thank you for your tireless service. Seeing the school like this, it feels totally different at night. The lights. I have to walk home when it's dark? When it's this dark? Come on. Well, okay. How, how do I go? The lights are out. Campus pond. Yeah, yeah, I know. The front gate of the school. Can't go home without going through it. I don't want to leave. I don't want to leave yet. What? Am I missing something? I'm supposed to... What else am I looking at? Oh, what the heck? There's a human being there. Someone's there. What you doing, Sarah? Hey, Joe. I like your 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 earring, I guess. Joe. Joe Tazuna, or rather, Joe. My classmate at school. We often found ourselves together. You stuck around this late for clubs? I was gonna wither up from waiting. Well, it's fine. Look. Alright, let's continue. I'm sorry. I, I dig your music, Joe. I truly do. Alright. <clears throat> well, it's fine. Listen, there's something I want to tell you. Something to tell me? My thanks! Thanks... for what, I wonder? Oh, you know, you introduced us, right? Me and Ryoko. Uh-oh. Right. She's such a good girl. I'm moved. 
Cute, huh? Adorable! <laughs> There's even a cat, or is that a dog? That's a dog. It's like tiny Scooby-Doo in your front pocket, and I appreciate it. Thank you, Joe. You're my new favorite. I ate a Donner kebab in one bite today. I'm a real glutton. Okay. Just any sort of kebab in one bite? That's impressive, Joe! <laughs> a whole Donner kebab. Wait, you went on a date? <laughs> Was on it till just a second ago. I came back to school so I could brag about it too, yeah. You should have gone home. Alright, bragging complete. Let's go home, Sarah. And there's the move icon. I guess we're gonna find some more icons too. Path home. That was some that was a funky beat. Then Ryoko and I finally... How long is the story? Stop bragging to me. <laughs> you listening? We made huge progress. This guy's such a pain. I don't care. Did you kiss or what? Did you kiss or what? K k don't be stupid. Doing that on the first date. That's... Uh, they call people like that monsters. <laughs> it's a freaking jail. At least you have some class. I don't really like your face staring at me like this, though. I, I I won't lie. It's too it's too full of expression. You're a villain. We old hands. Outrageous progress, right? I mean, it was mostly I fell in a ditch and she was helping me out, but <laughs> for how gaudy you look, you're awfully shy. Huh? Gaudy? This ain't. <laughs> I'm hurt, man. This, that, that seriously gets to me. Damn it. Maybe I should go to uh, go back to a crew cut like in middle school. Jeez, no, don't do that. Now he started moping. Is this better than him <laughs> being so obnoxiously? I'm, I'm happy for jail. Be happy for your friend, Sarah. Jeez. Alright, well, let's click things. A poster warning to watch out for strangers. Okay. What is, is that? I don't know. Streetlight? Streetlight, people, oh, 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 A faint streetlight illuminates the area. I've rarely ever walked home at this hour. It feels really dark. What's up? Wanna hold hands? Eh? Uh, I'd probably crush you with my amazing grip. Nah, forget it, Sarah. Since when do you have an amazing grip, Mr. I fell into a ditch? For real talk, wouldn't it help if you, you uh wow, wouldn't it help things if you got a boyfriend? You can't sleep, right? Because of your stalker. Is that why you always go home with me? T -t dummy I just wanted to brag. Thanks. Yeah, that's okay. See, I told you guys, Joe's a good guy. Good guy, Joe. And I'm I'm hoping that I'm not gonna regret saying that- <laughs> Hope that I don't regret saying good guy, Joe. Because you guys, a lot of you have already gone through a lot of this game, so... <laughs> me saying good guy, Joe? Hopefully, it doesn't come to bite me in the butt. I'm gonna have to save that, or save that little piece of this recording, because I'm sure it's gonna turn around on me. <laughs> Joe, please don't be a good guy. <laughs> Continue. <clears throat> well, if you... Just feel like being grateful. I won't stop you. Heh. <laughs> Alright, let's mosey along now. Your parents will be worried if you're late. Right. Uh. Can we, can we just move? Oh, uh, no, we can't move. Yikes. Uh-oh. I have to run. Joe, run. Huh? Ha! Ah. 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 Ha! Whew! We made it home. It's okay. Should be fine now that we're here. Joe. I don't know. Am I scared or am I relieved? I am scared. I'm a little scared. Because when I clicked that person, the eyes just flashed on the screen. I'm scared. Terrified. I'm terrified. I'm scared. Am I going to... What if he kills me someday? I'm not gonna let that happen, okay? Joe. Call on me. Anytime. 
I'll come with a boatload of freshmen. That guy was staring. And it seemed like he was trying to talk to me. Well, your parents are waiting, Sarah. I hope. Yeah. Hey, Joe. Thank you or be careful. I hope that these these text boxes don't make any any uh if I tell him to be careful, maybe he'll be careful and live, and what if I just say thank you and he dies? Thanks. It's all good. See you tomorrow. At school. Okay, I guess I'll go in. Hmm. The house lights aren't on. Uh let's investigate. Alright, a fancy lamp lights up the front porch. So it's not a power outage. That's not okay. I can see the living room through the window, but the lights aren't on. Use a flashlight. Okay. The house nameplate. Alright, what am I about to get myself into? I don't like this. I'm not a fan. Not okay. Not okay at all. Alright. This has done a very good job of setting up the scene very quickly. My good old front door. The door is unlocked. Yo, this is bad. Okay, well, let's go. It's dark. Why aren't the lights on? Mom, Dad, are you not home? The plant's falling over. Something's weird about this house. Can we go- Oh, man, we can't go back outside. That's bad news, bears. Over here is the bathroom. The living room. Normally, Mom and Dad would be in here watching TV and waiting for me. And that's your parents' room, so I guess we should go to the living room, right? Hold on. File 2. Don't mind if I do. Let's go to the living room. My parents should be in here. It's pitch black. This is bizarre. There can't be no one here. I'll turn on the lights. The light switch. Turn on lights. I have a bad feeling. No, stop, don't do it. Too dark to see. Too dark to see. Too dark to see. Fine. Turn on the lights, despite your bad feeling. Okay, I'm turning them on. <gasps> oh, no. What is this? There's a key on the floor. I'll take that. Why is this here? She's breathing. Okay, that's fine. What do I do? What do I do? Okay, well, this is not what I expected. Fancy containers. Great. A TV. All fantastic. My, my family trip to some area. Great. To bookshelves. Ranging from dad's complicated books to mangas and magazines. They're not all organized. Okay, great. That's not okay. Door to the hallway. Is there a phone? Door leading to my parents' room. Uh, okay, well, where can we move to? Back to the hallway. Okay, okay, just, how do I... Uh, I don't like... Okay, well, she's fainted, so where's Dad? Alright, well, back to the hallway. Sarah! Thank God, Joe! Joe! Joe, please help, my mom's collapsed. Stay calm, did you call the hospital? The cops? Not yet, I need to call... Somebody call my mama! Oh, wait, she's fainted. I'll handle it. Listen, Sarah, you need to be calm. Joe started to make a call. What am I doing? I'm all out of sorts. But I need to do something. Something. Second floor. It's locked. Why is my room locked? Yeah, I don't like this. I'm going back downstairs. Screw, screw my room. Where's Joe? Joe. 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 Okay, fine. Fine, you guys. Dad, where are you? Mom collapsed. Dad, where are... Uh... Your turn to die. Death game by majority. Presented by... non Kidai. Uh-oh. <laughs> Uh-oh. Ugh. Where is this? 
I wonder. So we just got kidnapped. Joe was here though, so he should be... Oh man, Joe, why didn't you come upstairs with us? I'm looking at the ceiling. Why am I sleeping here? I don't know if this is... Let's remember ourselves first. We had to remember ourselves, then we can remember our situation. I'm Sarah, and I'm an incredibly normal person attending school. Good. Start with what you know best. What about our situation? Er, I think I went home. Right, and then... Mom! Mom! I quickly tried to sit up, but I couldn't. Is there something on my head? Think calmly. Right now it seems like I'm lying down. On a bed. Maybe? What is the thing on my head? Touch it to check. I fearfully touch my head. Some kind of belt? Or a machine? Am I tied to it? It's like I'm being restrained. No way. Ah! What's the meaning of this? My temperature rose. Suddenly, fear awakened in me. No, where is this? Somebody! I had no freedom to move. Besides my head, my left arm, torso, and legs all seem to be restrained. But my right arm is A-OK. -okay. All I can move is my right arm. Someone! I was about to scream, then went quiet. The stalker. He, he, he'd harm my mom. He brought me here. I wonder, am I going to be murdered? <laughs> hmm. Sarah. Joe! <laughs> yes! <laughs> Are you there? That voice. Joe, is that you? Are you next to me? Yeah, but I can't move. Can't you do something? Joe's in the same situation. Oh, hold on, that's my phone. Oh, that's a phone. Uh, ask Joe. Joe, is that yours ringing? Eh? <laughs> You're right, something's in my pocket. Here. Hello? Whoever you are, help us. Help! <laughs> help! <laughs> Beginning voiced guidance. Huh? The first trial will begin now. Sarah and Joe, find the key hidden in this room. Then, remove your restraints. If you cannot do this before the time limit expires, the device on your beds will activate. And your bodies will be crushed with a thud. By all means, please enjoy this thrill with, your all, with all your body and soul. The time limit is a healthy five minutes. Oh no! And note there is only one key, so please discuss who will use it. What the heck is this? The first trial? We'll die in five minutes? What, 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 are we, what are we gonna do? There's no time to fret about that. Uh, 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 search pocket. I searched, I, I, so there's nothing in my pocket. What's up, Joe? Joe, check your clothes. Yikes. Uh, when I took my phone from my pocket, I might have dropped something. N no, no way, pick it up. Got it. Grabbed it, it's the key. That was surprisingly easy. All right. Let's wait, can I can I can I save right now? No, I cannot. Use that key. Hurry and use the key. You sure? If I do, you'll If that voice was telling me the truth, I might die. But Joe, I'm sure you can figure something out. Got it. I'll use it. Then I'll save you too. Definitely. Oh my goodness. <clears throat> that took some time. I need to save Sarah somehow. Alright, well, thank you for putting me into the save file. You know me better than me. Oh gosh, there's an actual time limit. A green lock. Joe, what should I do? No, not now, now. The red key. No, thank you. What's here? Sandpaper. Uh, there's 1374. A dial. Great. Yes. Uh, no, stop. 
No, no, what are you doing? Go left and right. Yeah, so one, three, se seven. I should have gone the other way. One, three, seven, four. That better be it. Great. What's in here? Did it just make a sound? It sure did. Uh, okay. No, we, we, it made a sound. Can we do something here now? You, uh, what's this, just, just, can, can, oh, just, just, uh, don't die. Uh, let's, let's try it, I guess. It's too big to fit. Iron door. Okay. Um. I oh, I did a thing. Can I cut this this red wire? Should I check? Should I look at the key again? What? Did a bit shave off of the end? Oh my gosh. Yes. Okay. Fine. You made me search everything. I was I was close enough to that. Here, use your green key. Save her life. Thank goodness. I didn't know there were actual time limits in this game. That's extremely stressful. <sighs> Thank you, Jail. Can you stand? <laughs> I I am more stressed out than I, than they are right now. I they're like, yeah, I'm fine. How are you? I'm good. Yeah, almost died, but yeah, it's fine. It's good. Yeah, let's let's leave. Let's get out of here now. Ah, wait, Joe. Damn it! It's pitch black. I can't see a thing. Go along the wall. Left is a dead end. Seems we can only go right. I mean it, Sarah. Don't let us get separated. Right. We kept going straight. Straight ahead. But as far as we walked, we didn't see any light. It seemed to be a very, very long hallway. Or maybe we weren't advancing much at all. Joe. Yes, use the phone for light. That phone you used earlier, could you try using that to light the way? Nice one, Sarah. Man, you're smart. Well, there was only one other option, and running into the darkness seems like a bad idea. Did you bring it? Ah, I left it back there. I guess that's that, then. Hmm, what can give us some light? We tried searching ourselves when suddenly... Whoa. What? Wind blowing from underneath. My feet left the ground. Am I flying? Am I about to die? <laughs> no, we're falling. The floor gave way. Eek! How long? How high? How far are we falling? My senses growing distant. We just... we just die? Hey! Get up! Oh, it's a bunch of people. <clears throat> Hello? You, you can't sit there stupefied forever, miss. Eh? <laughs> Where is this? Beats me. Ah. I'm alive! Alright, we're good! We're not even hurt. We're great. Fantastic. Alright. People! <laughs> Yo. What the hell are you guys? Who the hell are you guys? Where even is this? Like we've got any idea ourselves. Calm down, lady. <laughs> Woman in overalls. <laughs> Is there anyone here who can explain? <laughs> <clears throat> Man in apron. Just what is going on? How troubling. They seem too distracted to take any notice of me, who had just maybe fallen from the ceiling. What in the world is happening? Alright, well. We didn't die. It was not our turn to die this time, you guys. Uh, how long? How long are we? I just, I don't really know when to separate these episodes, to be honest. Um, we're 30 minutes in. That seems like a good episode length. Yeah. I'm gonna take off for this episode. But first, we're gonna do my favorite thing in the world, and we are going to... Say, how many slots? There's gonna be like 20. Ooh, that's way more than 20. Oh, your boy's about to have so many save files. Number four. <laughs> so, <laughs> Next episode is gonna be fun. Tell me! Wait, this person is confirmed. Student of yes. 
We have to read everything, you guys. Read every single thing. Tell me, uh... What is in our glossary? We still have this red key, that's good to know. Tell me! How many times, how many save files do you think I'm gonna go through in this game? Tell me. <laughs> Tell me, because I'm curious. <sighs> that's what I want to know in the comments, and... Next episode, I guess we meet all of these 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 other people? It might even be 9 other people if one of you was Joe. I think that one's Joe, so it might be 9 other people. I'm United States Aviator, and I'm taking off. Stay classy, passengers, in this year of the Aviator. We will be back soon with more Your Turn to Die, because it started off as a rush, and I hear that it only gets better, or maybe rushier, because let me tell you, I had to search everything in that room before I was able to do anything. Yikes. <laughs> yikes, 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 yikes. Alright. Stay classy. Toodaloo. Light crew.